Yo, what is good, everybody? dusty 4 kicks here. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be checking out a pair that a lot of people already reviewed. They were super hyped back when they came out. Now, not so much. These are a collaboration with a anime that I watched. I don't even know how long ago. Pretty long time ago. And that is none other than the Nike SB Gundam collaboration on the Dunk High Unicorns. Let's go ahead and check them out. Alright guys, this pair is coming from a seller named Boostmaster Lin. Now you probably already know who that is, but on the off chance that you don't, I'm going to go ahead and put their information right here on the screen so you can go ahead and check them out. Full disclosure, pretty sure retail came with a sticker pack of all the like little unicorn logos and stuff like that. In my opinion, not a big deal that it's missing, but that is something I wanted to include just in case that's something you guys are worried about. First things first, we have this really cool special edition Nike SB Gundam box. You can see the top is red, this is Nike SB and the swoosh in white, as well as Unicorn Gundam Destroy Mode version Nike SB, the Bondi logo, all kinds of stuff that I also cannot read because I'm not smart enough. You can even see the Gundam model back there in red behind the Nike SB logo. Flipping over the box, you can see more writing, but you can actually see the model that the Gundam, the shoes are based off of, which I thought was really cool. There's even more details like this is the rest of the actual Gundam and you know other pieces of him so i thought that was a pretty cool little touch in my opinion as far as accessories go you got these really cool interchangeable gold swooshes the ones that come on the shoes automatically are yellow but the velcro rips them off and you can replace them with those you also have two sets of laces one being the red that just unraveled as i did that and the other one being this really cool green color taking a closer look there are a lot of little details to go over so we already know that this is based off of the Unicorn Gundam suit in the Gundam movie, show, whatever you want to say. First off, we have the really nice white uppers, just regular leather. But you can see all these really cool cuts of this. It's kind of like a mix between red and pink, kind of like a fuchsia color. Definitely reminds me of the Fusion Jordan 1 colorway that released last year. But that's all over. You can see the cuts all through here. Even the unicorn logo right here. This is RX-0 Dunk High and then Warning. Which is no doubt something from the show mixed in with obviously the Dunk High branding. But you can see even the stitching is that same really cool color all over. That's on the lace guard as well as up here, back here. You can see this really cool black piece cut out. And you still see the really nice fuchsia is what we're going to say color for the cool lining the swoosh you can see is this really cool yellow one it's to show you the same as the i think like the headpiece that the gundam robot suit is wearing when he changes into the unicorn mode or whatever it's called but this is a velcro one so like i said you can change it to the gold one if you'd like you can see this is the clean white midsole color, but you can see there's more of that red pink colorway right there for the thread. Outsole, it's kind of like a navy blue color with that fuchsia Nike SB hit right there on the center. Toe box, you can see more of the cool details to make it look like the Gundam suit right there with these cool, I don't know if it's air vents or just kind of pieces to the suit, but super cool details in my opinion, more of that fuchsia colorway. You can see there's some black lining right here. I do believe that you can kind of strip off this white and I think there's more fuchsia below. Not sure if that's something I'm going to personally do, but it is a cool detail if you're someone that like skates your actual shoes. White thin SB laces, but I did show you that the red and the green also come with it. Nice black mesh tongue. Tongue tag is yellow with Nike SB and Dunk Low Pro and the swoosh in green. I want to say that kind of symbolizes the little green square that's on his head in between the yellow headband that the swoosh kind of represents. Inside the shoe, we got that really nice soft fuchsia color for the mesh sock liner. You can also see the insole right there in black. And then it says Zoom Air, Nike SB, and the swoosh in that fuchsia red-pink color. 
Back side of the shoe, you can see right here, this is where the Velcro is for the swoosh. You can see the regular white leather right here, but still that really cool lining in that fuchsia color. Black back here, and just like I said over here, you can see there's more fuchsia stitching and lining. You got the white heel tab that sticks out pretty nicely with the little fuchsia square right there. Medial side, this is the side where the swoosh is down. You can't do anything about it. It's not Velcro or anything like that. You have to keep this yellow swoosh. And you can see there's cool indents and markings on it. No doubt details of the suit. But other than that, you still have the regular white uppers with the cool lining and little hits of that fuchsia color. Right shoe, you got the same thing. Really cool black piece right here for the ankle. And you can see the nice hits of that fuchsia as well as the white leather all over the uppers with the stitching and the little cuts and hits of that fuchsia pink red colorway. You can still see the unicorn logo right there, RX-0 Dunk High and then Warning. Again, like I said, something from the show movie, also collaborated with the Dunk branding. Midsole, you can just see clean white, nothing too crazy, but then you got the red stitching right there as well. Also, like I said, it's like a navy blue color with the Fuchsia Nike SB hit right there on the center of it. Toe box, again, you got the really cool inserts or cuts. I'm not sure if it's ventilation or just details of the suit. More of the Fuchsia hits right there. You got the black hit right here because the suit isn't just white and Fuchsia. There are pieces of black as well. White thin SB laces, black mesh tongue, tongue tag in yellow with the green Nike SB swoosh and Dunk High Pro. Again, I think that's the little square on his head and then the headband piece is the yellow. Inside of the shoe, just like the other one, you got the really nice fuchsia color mesh sock liner. You got the black insole with the fuchsia hits of the Nike SB and Zoom Air. Back side of this one, you still see where the swoosh hits the Velcro right there. You got the white leather with the little fuchsia hits. You got the black leather with the fuchsia hits as the stitching right there, even a little square box on the white heel tab in that fuchsia color. Medium side to finish up the whole shoe. Once again, it is that really nice white leather with the little fuchsia hits all over. I do think you can scratch this off and skate it or do whatever you wanna do custom wise. And it's that nice fuchsia color under there as well. And then this is the side where you have the yellow swoosh with the cool little indents and details. That is not Velcro and you cannot take off. All right, so like I said, when the Gundam show was out, I was such a young little kid. All I really remember are people getting into big armored robot suits, kind of like Transformers, but not exactly. It's like a Japanese Transformers. But I am going to revisit the show and watch it a little bit at some point in the near future, hopefully. But as far as the suit that they based the shoe off of, I think they got all these really, really cool details the Velcro swoosh that you can replace with the gold one, all the little hits of the red, the fact that it's another obviously Nike SB shoe that you can skate and the paint and the white will come off to have that more fusion red pink kind of color. I think they put a lot into this and I definitely appreciate it. What do you guys think? Let me know down below. Are you rocking with these or is this one that you would probably just drop? Just like always, I really appreciate you guys coming over to the channel and hanging out for a bit. Till next time, I'm Dusty4Kicks. Peace.